Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Lee Kirby Ditko Comics and in this video I have a few awesome comics to show you. Uh, I recently got these so I just felt I really wanted to show you guys these. So that's why my pickups is a little bit earlier than I usually do it. But anyway guys, thanks for obviously, you know, watching this. But I wanted to let you guys know that I made an Instagram and I also made a Twitter so you can go follow me on Instagram at Lee Kirby Dicko Comics and Twitter at Lee Kirby Dicko Comics or Twitter it's LKD Comics. Anyway, guys, let's get into this uh, complex pickups number nine. First book I picked up is this Iron Man number one, which is an awesome book. Uh, this is a little bit lower grade, but it's just an awesome book, and I got it for an amazing price. Um, especially for the price that it's going at now, it's a really awesome book, especially for the price I paid. So it's a real good book to have. Next book, huge, huge book. From the same guy, I bought this Hulk 181, the first appearance of Wolverine. Which is uh, it's obviously a huge, huge key book, the number one Bronze Age book. And uh, has the Marvel value stamp. And it's it's a great book, and I got it for a great price. A little bit lower grade too, but you know, honestly, for a bit, you know, lower to mid grade copy, I paid a great price, and it's still an awesome book, no matter what the condition is. All right, next two books I purchased from the same guy, and I recently opened up the package because I bought them online, and that is. Amazing Spider-Man number 10, which this is an awesome book, awesome book, early Spider-Man, really early Spider-Man. Obviously, all these books, I already have them all in better condition, but these are all basically books that, you know, are now, I always have books for trade and for, you know, I'm always selling books, so if any of you guys want any books, specifically, specific books that you want, PM me and we can talk, but earn that, um... So yeah, Spiron 10, so it's a really awesome book, and I got it for an amazing price. It's a little bit lower grade, but displays pretty amazing, pretty nice for the grade. Uh, next Spider-Man is an even earlier one, Amazing Spider-Man number 8, which is uh, number 10. Number 10 was the first appearance of the Enforcers. And number 8 is actually a Fantastic Four appearance. Where Jack Kirby draws the artwork on the second story with the Fantastic Four. So this is a really awesome single digit Spidey. I mean, this is one of the the cheapest, the ch the cheapest, jeez, the cheapest Silver Age uh, single digit. And it's, it's, I, it's in my opinion, it's one of my favorites because it's just an awesome book. And I do really like that cover even though it's one, not one of my favorite covers. I do really like it. So it's a really awesome book. And then the book that is the piece of resistance, it's the the amazing, amazing book that I got. And this is uh, obviously my first copy of this. And a lot of people haven't seen my dad's copy um, because I, I, I that's not one of the books I showed in the best comic book collection in the world. So some people were saying, oh, you need to get Brave and the Bold 28. But, boom. Brave and the Bold number 28, guys. Look at that, man. Look at that. First appearance of the Justice League of America. America. <laughs> Brave and the Bull 28. First appearance of the Justice League. This is such an awesome book. Such an awesome book. And I'm so happy to have it. I got an amazing, amazing price. And it is in pretty nice condition. Um, and when I say pretty nice, I mean really nice condition. Okay, guys, that's going to wrap up this comic book pickups number nine. Thanks, obviously, for subscribing to my channel. If you haven't already done so, do so. Also, like this video because it's freaking Brave the Bull 28. How could you go wrong? Also, comment down below which of these books were your favorite. So, I want to hear, was it Brave the Bull 28? Was it Iron Man 1? Was it Hulk 181? Was it Spider-Man 10? Or was it Amazing Spider-Man number 8? I want to know your guys' feedback. So, anyway guys, thanks for watching this video. I'm Lee Kirby Dicko Comics, and go follow me on Instagram and Twitter, and I'll see you next time, guys. Thanks. Yeah.
made the sulky over funky kind of hokey superhero a twisted and electrically transistored superhero an exotically neurotic and aquatic superhero the marvel superheroes have arrived